Hey guys, Parfax here. Today I have a pretty short, cool video for you. So, um, first I want to say that there will be a giveaway in the comment section down below. I will let you know about that towards the end of the video. Um, but this video is mainly about the channel, the way I'm going to do builds on the channel here in the upcoming future. So basically what I'm going to do, like I'm on my Magic Nightblade here, I'm going to do builds that are very tailored to one specific type of thing. Um, or overall everything so what that means is basically you know most people put out here's the best pvp build right here's the best pvp build well that might be great in battlegrounds and maybe is good for 1vxing in cyrdo but let's be honest most people don't 1vx in cyrdo when you go into cyrdo you're gonna see hundreds of people and rarely do you ever see anybody 1vxing so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start breaking my builds down to Battleground builds, Theodel builds, you know, um, solo roaming builds for PvE, maybe fun builds like Werewolf and Vampire builds. Um, we're going to break them down a lot more. And the one thing that I literally never see anybody do is Zerg builds for PvP. Now, there's going to be a couple even versions of those zerg builds I'll, pr I'll put it all into one video but what it'll be is something that you can run in group because let's be honest if you're in sealed right now and you look up a pvp build and you don't know what you're doing let's say you run um unleashed and red mountain right well that's really good for battlegrounds and 1v1ing and to a smaller extent 1vxing but it's not great for Cyrdo. Like, unless you're 1vxing, but if you're 1vxing, let's be honest, you really don't need to look up builds. If you're truly 1vxing, you because you can actually just see, you, you can pretty much do it on your, your own. You might get some ideas, but you really don't need somebody to tell you your build. So when people go into Cyrodiil, they're, they're running a lot of times these 1vx builds when they should be running a different type of build to kind of not only bring some group utility, but to have really a more tailored experience. When you do something like Cyrodiil, you wanna have a lot of AOE. You wanna have stuff that really buffs your AOE. Now, I'll do builds that are like small group focused, which are gonna be a mix of single target and AOE with um, some big bursts. Like for instance, like a Nightblade, instead of running in cap, you're gonna probably run Dawnbreak because you're gonna wanna have multiple, you're gonna wanna have AOE, but you don't necessarily wanna run straight AOE, like maybe a full Zerg, you know, Zerg build. So that's the way I'm gonna kind of take my channel from now on. Um, I don't think there's really many people out there doing anything like that. A lot of people just do their, you know, their fancy PVP builds like I do. Um, you know, I mean, I've put my fair share of them out there, um, but they're really now gonna be sort of tailored in a specific way. And you're gonna know right off the bat, well, if I wanna play Nightblade Cyrodiil, and I want to run in the Zerg with all my other friends, right? This is going to be the build I can run versus a just a single target battleground build, which I can run here. And then I will try to do, and it's really, really hard. I've successfully done it on one character so far. If you haven't seen that video, you really should. I'm going to be updating that build. But I did a PvE slash PvP Nightblade build, and it did pretty damn good pve dps and it was actually severe or like very successful in pvp and you didn't have to change one thing now was it min maxed of course not because you're never going to min max a pve or pvp character but you literally could buy one thing for the setup and be absolutely golden all right oh look we got a uh oblivion portal well, we're gonna go into that um That's right. I even know my bars here. Um, but yeah, so that's kind of the way we're going to go. Um, so when it comes to the giveaway, we're going to be doing a giveaway if we can get at least 20 comments and 20 likes on the video. I will do a 100K. No, you know, we'll do a 300K giveaway on PCNA. Unfortunately, I have to basically um get all this myself i don't have anybody giving me gold like some other people um so unfortunately this is just gonna be for pcna so if you are on pcna 
go ahead and like or like and comment down below comment which um build you want to see next do you want to see a pvp um i don't know zerg nightblade you know if you want to see a battlegrounds um stand blade you know whatever you want to see comment down below what you want to see and if you just say stand blade that's fine um or you know mag blade or you know what i'll even accept it if you just put nightblade or templar i know but let me know comment section down below make sure you comment which one if once we get to 20 likes and 20 comments oh at least 20 likes and 20 comments we will do a giveaway if it absolutely blows up which who knows and we get like 100 likes and 100 comments i'll do another 30k giveaway so just because you see the 20 likes and because maybe i've given it away still make sure you slap that like button slap that comment down in there uh because i could be doing another giveaway as well like i said this is all my money and 600k takes me a little while to get but it is worth it you guys have been great the youtube channel has been i don't want to say blowing up but man we've really started to take off i had literally my best day since i've came back on youtube yesterday i'm even getting the troll comments which makes my heart feel good <laughs> all right guys Thanks for watching. Enjoy your time in Blackwood. I know sometimes I'm salty, but, you know, that's okay. Again, if you want to see me on Twitch, I stream um, at Parfax Gaming. So Twitch.tv slash Parfax Gaming. I'd greatly appreciate it stop by. But if not, I appreciate you stopping by here on the YouTube channel. All right, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.